Dana really does look stressed about all this. That looks like a home pregnancy test. Of course a popular cheerleader like Dana would have a million friends. It's so fascinating to get a peek into Dana's social media world. And yes, Max, so terribly wrong. Hey, Dana. Seriously, thanks again. I can't believe Juliet locked me in my own room. Real mature. Victoria is not nice. I don't get it. She has everything. And to pull that prank on a friend? Just because they're in the Vortex Club doesn't mean they're BFFs. I'm in it, and Victoria creeps me out. Max, you're smart to be a loner here. Though Warren obviously likes hanging with you. What do you mean? Oh, nothing. When you opened the flash drive, didn't you see the special folder called Max? Yeah, okay. I gotcha. Are you blushing? <laughs> Go ahead and grab the flash drive whenever. Oh, Max, that's mine. Thank you. You're not helpful. You're just nosy. I think you better go. Nice, Max. You hurt her feelings by being so damn nosy again. But I could rewind and make it up to her. There's no more gossip for you here, Max. So go. I assume Dana kept the appointment. Must protect my precious so Max never has to chase it down again. Hey, Dana. Dana, I'm not trying to be nosy, but I heard a rumor about you. What? Who told you I was pregnant? Nobody important. They just acted like it was bullshit. I just wanted you to know. It's like a goddamn reality show around here. Can you keep a secret, Max? Of course. I... was pregnant. Was. Oh. What about the other... Deadbeat Dad? You can catch him on the 40-yard line this Friday. And it's not Zachary. Sorry to pry. It's not my business. And I won't be at the game Friday. Not much school spirit, I guess. I like your spirit, Max. Anyway, you better get that flash drive so Warren has an excuse to bug you. this shit. Ow! That hurt. Damn. I better rewind. Alyssa, move your head. If you insist, Max. Now that's what I'm talking about. I actually helped somebody.
Now that's what I call instant karma. Max, that was awesome. Thank you. That was close. Jock assholes. If I was a member of the Vortex Club, they'd never pull that. Would you want to be a member? They're smart. We should hang out more. Now I have to finish this stupid book. Get lost, hipster. I'm not doing any interviews. So don't think I'm blind. I see everything here at Blackwell. Do you understand what I'm saying? No, and leave me alone. Hey, why don't you leave her alone? Excuse us, this is official campus business. Excuse me, you shouldn't be yelling at students or bullying them. Hey, hey, nobody is bullying anybody. I'm doing my job. No, you're not. You're part of the problem, Missy. I will remember this conversation. That was great. I think you scared him for once. I have to go, but thank you. It means a lot. Anytime, Kate. I felt like an everyday hero helping Kate, but now Officer David Dickhead is after me. Maybe I should rewind and mind my own business? <laughs>